All right, now we're going to cover the installation of our one and three quarter inch spinners to increase the efficiency of our elite boilers. Uh, here's the unit, stainless steel. Typically, you put it in, and then you. I take a pair of regular pliers and turn, spin it as I push it in and I leave the end uh, just even with the end of the tube. So I usually stick it in, then put my pliers on it, spin it as I turn it. Uh, I usually put them in the same way. If by chance your uh, tube has weld that sticks out, uh, you can use a grinder and grind the area of the spinner that is catching. I usually use a pair of ice grips. Uh, just touch it up and keep fitting it for the uh, tube that you're trying to put it in. And then I keep it, if I have to do that, I keep those uh, in a little box when I pull them out to clean so that they go back in the same tube. So to remove them same way, I put my uh, pliers on it and I spin them as I bring the uh, tube out. And that's how I always put them in the same direction. And Put them, see, it's, it's hard to do it with just your hands because you bind it up. But if you use the pliers, you can spin it as you put it in. And it seems to work real well because uh, we turn past this front lip where the uh, spinners would tend to catch. So that's... Uh, that's all you got to do to install them. That's the installed look. You want it uh, lined up with the end. And here's what I use typically uh, for a box. And I just put slots in it. And then I put the spinners on the box in relation to where they go in the boiler. So that's the installation of the high-efficiency exhaust spinners.